Yo, what's going on, guys? And we just heard that the Lakers have made a trade. Yes, you guys just saw it on the screen. The Lakers have acquired. They already have the 17th pick in this year's draft. And they have a second round pick in this year's draft as well. But they got themselves another second round pick from the Indiana Pacers who were trying to get rid of some of their picks in this year's draft. They went out and got themselves the 40th pick in this year's draft, which we can all agree was a good deal for the team as they, you know, they needed it. They needed it. And what it'll allow them is to go get a guy who might slip out of the first and be there, who can be, you know, a, a day one effective player for them. As I've said, Jalen Wilson is a guy that's probably going to be targeted. Marcus Sasser. There's going to be guys like maybe Ben Shepard out there that could, you know, be impact players for them. And I think this is a good move for this team as they're going to definitely want to try and find themselves guys like Max Christie last year, or even better, who can be impact players. I mean, we've seen Herb Jones and it was basically they acquired the 40th pick from the Indiana Pacers for the 47th pick, which was their other that was the second round pick they had in cash. So they just moved up seven spots and that's going to allow them to get potentially a first round talent that might have slipped and fallen out of the first. So. I think this is a huge move on their part because now it allows them to go out and get themselves a player that could potentially be, you know, of, you know, of value. Again, like I said, we saw a few seasons ago, Herb Jones, impact player, found it in the second round by the New Orleans Pelicans. So th this is the type of stuff that teams like the Lakers, they're not messing around. They're trying to go out and get themselves talent on this team and i think that's something that people need to realize is quite possible so uh, i do want to hear your guys's thoughts what do you guys think and why but i definitely think it's going to be interesting as more and more time passes and i wonder if they're going to be able to you know find a good player in the second round this is a this is a good draft there's a lot of talent in it i i just want to hear who do you guys think might be someone that they target as they clearly are moving up because they think somebody's going to be available at that range and i don't know who but that's who i want to hear you guys think i think maybe maybe brandon potizemski could fall kobe jones could fall marcus sasser could fall you know, there could be a big that falls. There's a lot that could happen there. So I want to hear your guys' thoughts down below in the comment section on who do you guys expect to be on the Los Angeles Lakers lineup. But besides that, I am going to head out, like, comment, and subscribe. If there was anything else you guys would have liked to hear, tell me down below in the comment section. But till next time, guys, puppies. Ooh, toot.